Do you have knee pain? Hello, welcome to Nursing with Professor B. My name is Bridget, I'm a family nurse practitioner. In today's video, I'll be going over stretches that can help alleviate your knee pain. Everything in the body is connected. So if we stretch the hamstring, the calves, it will help your knee pain. So go put something comfy on and I will meet you on the mat. Consistency is the best way to get better, so commit to yourself. Do these stretches every day for one week. The second week, you can start by slowing down to every other day. Make sure that before you stretch or do any kind of strengthening or flexibility program that you always check with your healthcare provider. But first, you're just gonna put your two hands against the wall for, for stability so that you don't fall. And you're going to bend, you're going to bend the left leg and you're going to lean into the wall so that you stretch, you're stretching your calf. Believe it or not, everything is connected. It's a domino effect. So if your calves are tight, it's going to affect your knee also. So you're going to lean into the wall, make sure that your toes are flat, and you're going to hold this stretch for 30 seconds to one minute. And then after it's been 30 seconds to one minute, you will switch. I bought this on Amazon in case that you wanna give it a try, just be careful on it. You also, it's the same premise. I'll put, if you're interested in it, I'll put it in the description below. This also is going to stretch out the calf and it will help with plantar fasciitis. So you also just balance and then you roll and you also hold for 30 seconds to one minute. And you would do the same thing on the other side. If you don't feel the stretch on the wall, you can come down to the floor. You can put one foot in front of the other. I feel this, I feel the stretch. And you can stretch out your calf like this. You can also do downward dog. But this one, I, I can really feel it. The next stretch is a quadricep stretch. This is your quadricep. And if these muscles are tight, they're going to pull on your knee and you're going to get that knee pain. So really simple, you just need to put your hand against the wall and you're going to pull your quadricep up. I, again, I'm flexible. Do not strain, like, don't try to get up this high, like, Ugh! Form is more important than you injuring yourself because you're trying to prove point and like get your leg up here. So if you're down here, that's fine. If you have a strap you can, and you're not that flexible, you can always strap like this so that you're down here, you still feel the stretch. If you don't have a strap, just grab what you have available. I just grabbed a shirt here, a long sleeve shirt. I'm gonna loop it around and you can just do that, right? so that you, if you can't get down there. So you also want to hold this stretch for 30 seconds to one minute. Make sure you do both sides. Again, this is going to stretch the quadricep and thereby helping relieve some of the tension that you will accumulate around your knee. The next stretch is going to be a hamstring stretch. So again, if you're not flexible, you can grab a strap, you can grab a towel, you can grab a shirt, whatever you have available to you. You can do it barefoot if it helps you get better of a grip. So you're just going to put the strap and you're just going to pull back. Don't injure yourself. You're just, and if you want to leave a slight bend in the knee, you can. And you're pulling back until you feel a little bit of resistance. Now a pro tip, press against the strap for three seconds. So one, two, three, I'm putting resistance. <sighs> Exhale, and then you can pull back. Again, 30 seconds to one minute. And the other side as well. If you don't have a strap, you can pull on a shirt. If you don't have anything, you can just pull wherever you feel. You never wanna press on the joint, so you can either hold here or up here. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you hit the like button, make sure you subscribe, and make sure you turn on that notification bell.